Hello and welcome back to Oscar Poorly Plays. My name is Oscar, and today we are doing episode 6 of Beholder. And I can't wait to fix up lonely Alocious Spack with a woman. And uh, also maybe not get Mr. Man evicted. Mr. Shimmer there. We don't want that. My daughter's unhappy. Look at that. Look at how unhappy she is. I don't have time for that. Um, okay, I got one hour, so I'm going to go wait up here. And then as soon as that hour drops, I'm going to go collect the papers. We're going to knock. Oh, he's over here. Okay. The bell dings. What do you want? Um, here's your paper. The archive rats lost it. I found. Okay, issued for Klaus Shimmer. These are issued. Gotcha. Okay. Um, where is Klaus? Is he in his house? Klaus is... He's over here. Okay. Hello. Um, talk about the documents. I still can't believe you decided to help us. Any news? Take your absentee. You're a free person now. Incredible. You did it. Now nothing will prevent you from leaving. I'm afraid it's not so good. My wife tried to buy a train ticket. But they didn't sell them. It seems we're in the plaque list. We must find a way to leave the city or even leave the country. Can you help? I'll try to think of something. Think something out. Blacklist is not ex an execution one. I don't know what that means. My gratitude knows no bounds. I started believing in people when I met you. Okay. Cool. Farewell, motherland. Okay, so if I can get him out of here... Then, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do. I don't want to evict him. I like him too much. Help Shimmers escape. Okay. First, let's go talk to, uh, friendly, uh, friendly Shpack over here. Okay. Hello. Talk about the loneliness. Any preference? Who would you like to meet? Anyone but your wife and daughter? Well, Thank you, my daughter's a child. And the old ladies from above. I don't mind old women, but you see I'm not even 50. There's no one above. I found you a girlfriend. Who is she? Just kidding. I didn't find you a girlfriend. That's cruel. What? I, okay. Am I allowed to call? How, how do I make a phone call? Dial 27... Okay. Yes. I'm calling about your ad. How interesting. Tell me about yourself. Oh, no. This is for a friend of mine. Ready to meet a great doctor? A doctor? What's his name? Alosha Speck. Is that the one the newspaper wrote about? Let me call you back in a couple hours. Okay? Okay, cool. I gotta wait. Okay, now... Oh, let's see what my son wants. Because I don't want him to be unhappy now, do I? Yes, father. Um, ask about the news. About study at the university. I haven't missed any class. To be honest, I haven't believed you can get this place in the university for me. Be a diligent student, son. This place costs us too much. I won't let you down, father. Um, talk about work. Your your boss is so nasty. Do you like eating good food? And s oh, I sorry. I gotta go. I gotta go. Don't care. Oh, that's probably uh the uh the caller. For Spack. Hello, Carl. It's Clara. You called me a couple of hours ago. I don't recall giving her my name. Uh, I agree to meet your doctor. Give him my number and a secret word. Strawberry with cream. Okay. Wrote down. I'll be waiting for his call. Okay. Wait. Who's calling? Who is calling? I have no idea who's calling. Or where Shpack is. We're going to wake him up. He deserves to be woken up for this. Oh. 
Guess I should knock, huh? All right, let's talk to him. Hello. I can play the loneliness. Uh, ladies, I found your girlfriend. Who is she? Um, girl from the ad. Great. Can't wait to meet her. The number? Call. She is waiting. I will call her today, but I need to gather my... Can you find me a chocolate bar? It's not okay to come to a date with empty hands. Okay. I guess I'm buying a fucking chocolate bar for you. Just take a look. Uh, $75 for a fucking chocolate bar? Are you joking? Where is he? Where the hell is he? Is he back in his house? And who is ringing? I have no idea. Oh, he's over here. Hello. Talk about the chocolate. Did you bring chocolate? I bought it. Great. I'm ready to date. Talk about chocolate. Okay. Great. Uh, farewell, motherland. Can I get on the bus? Alright, I guess I'll go talk to my wife. Cause I what, Carl? Learn what happened. Anything happened? Martha's sick. We have no medicine at home. Can you find aspirin? I've been waiting in line for age, only to find out that a prescription is needed. Of course I'll find him. I'll find him? Just a fever heat. Okay, in the dialogue. Okay, Martha's sick. Help oh, Shimmer's escape. Okay. Um. Wait. Oh. Who is she? Let's go talk to her. Hello. Talk about plans. What are you going to do next? Thanks to you, everything is fine with cost documents. Or even leave the country. I dream of a house far in the south. Whatever. I can, this must be a mistake. To be honest, the neighboring cities are the same. At least here I have a job. I bet you'll find a way to leave the city and move as far as you can. Okay. Whose phone is ringing? Oh, I guess she's playing Xbox. Okay, we gotta get to this phone. And we gotta find out how, uh. Yeah, I don't know. What do you like to know? Okay, someone's phone is ringing. It's driving me crazy. Yes, Father, talk about, I don't care. Don't care what you have to say. I have important matters of business. Is uh, Shpack home? He needs medicine. Doesn't he? I guess he is not home. Not home at one bit. Let's see. Maybe uh, Rannick can help. I don't know. Because I don't know how to do this. I do got to get to uh, that store, though, for the aspirin. Up. I don't know if Spack has it. I'm assuming... In the dialogue, I gotta get to him. Let's see what he wants. Oh, that's Spack. That is Spack. Hello. Okay. 
can, uh, Clara that you introduced me to is wonderful. Can she move in with me? Um, of course. Thanks, I'll pay you. Sweet. After a first date. Let's see, let's see what happens, okay? What do you want? Um, lost glasses. I've lost my glasses, Carl, and I can't work in the archives without them. Help an old man. It's just ordinary glasses, but I can't buy a pair. Rose will go there and take the coupon to the doctor. I can't wait a whole month. Or Okay, I'll search the house. Hurry up. I'll lose my job. Um, ask about the aspirin. Do you have aspirin? Aspirin? No, I don't know anything about medicine. My wife deals with this. Okay, where is your beautiful wife? Maybe she back knows. Hello. It's about aspirin. Do you have any aspirin? Why does everyone like those pills? Can you get these medicines? No, it breaks my heart to say no to you. But I have no right to prescri prescribe. You have to go to the hospital or trade it with those who don't need it. Okay. Um, wait, his wife, his wife, his wife, his wife. Um, is she in there? I don't know. I really can't tell. There she is. I gotta talk to you, lady. Where do you think you're going? Hello. Um, talk about plans. Wait. Okay. I gotta get them out. I gotta ask them some questions. I gotta find this aspirin. I only have 31 hours before she dies. I wonder if she would die. I can't. I don't. Oh, I think she's coming out. Good. Good afternoon. Do you know where I can buy aspirin? I don't know. I was given this in the hospital. Do you have aspirin? Can you give me the pills, Rose? Ask anything you want. My daughter is sick. What do you want? The weather is so nasty. Bring me a cardigan then. Find the cardigan and back to the talk later. Okay, dear. I hope my husband doesn't take the pills until you're back. Let me know if you have any problems, okay? Who is she? Oh, is this the new lady? I think it is. Hi, handsome. Uh, hello. How about the ad? Did you get a lot of calls about the ad? At least 40. A pretty woman always attracts admirers, you know. But Alocious is the most promising candidate. <laughs> well, good, because she's fucking moved in with him. In the, with the candidate. I always wanted to meet a renowned doctor. Do you think he knows a lot of celebrities here? I don't know, but think quite a few. Wonderful. Can't wait to host a dinner with his friends. Okay, she's up to no good. You can see right through me, Carl. I really need your help. Find me a bottle of something strong, can you? I'll pay well. I'm bored. Okay. Um, I need to find a cardigan. Drunk and happy, missing glasses, Martha is sick. This fucking phone is driving me insane. Talk about Martha's health and aspirin. How's Martha? I, not yet. Shh. Okay. Um, all right, so I appear to have come to a standstill, and I don't want to run this any longer than it needs to be. So that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Certainly do appreciate it. If you like this episode... Well, maybe let me know. And uh, if you didn't, well, I'll see you next time on Oscar Poorly Plays. Thank you for watching.